Not too shabby. Just about done our main area here. Got the Centaur Warriors. Haven't gotten too many free pot shots at us, because again, that's a, a recipe for disaster to say the least. Oh, Sip Moon, come back to gifting me books, please. I promise. It'll, it'll be worth it. Ah, I see. You weren't a real boulder beetle at all. You son of a gun, you lied to me. Can't do that. Oh, that's so much worse. Okie dokie, resistant to poison and cold, 71 health. Don't look at me, please. Okay, this uh, shapeshifter cannot make up their mind. Let's just get the heck out of there for the time being and maybe find them when they're in a slightly uh, more manageable mood. See what we get. I guess the last Minotaur that we had there probably should have stuck around and fight. Minotaur without javelins is basically just free real estate. But hey, live to fight another day and all that. Which stairs do we just go up? You know? I couldn't tell you, so let's do a quick one of these, forget the whole floor, and wander about again trying to find our shapeshifter pal. Something that we can definitely never afford to do on Meteorin when I do eventually get around to uh, checking those bad boys out. Now that I can deal with. Just murder. Fantastic. So and then we can undo the forget, and that is absolutely wonderful. Take a sip of our drink while we decide where we wish to head next, shall we? I guess eventually we're going to have to deal with Snake. It is just an Anaconda and a Mana Viper. Shouldn't kill us in one turn, so maybe I was a little bit dramatic when we first left the area. Let's head back. Hopefully not immediately die. Well, we didn't immediately die. So... We kind of keep them off of our back. Alternatively, we could let them in and just try to irradiate before they get a chance to do anything too, too uh, dangerous. Especially if we kind of head up to start off, stay away from the Naga. Just keep them at a, a nice, safe distance. Well, turns out this was the, the wrong choice to make. Hello, Moglottle. 140 health, huh? And you're resistant to electricity and cold? Or, and poison, rather? Only real shot is to radiate you, but if I bring you into melee range, then I feel like I'm going to be in a little bit of, of trouble to say the least. That's just the Black Mamba bite and it puts us in a terrible spot. So let's read teleport. Let's immediately irradiate to just try and kill that son of a gun. Get shafted out of there or shipped out of there by our teleport scroll. And now we're committed I guess. This, this is our, our life now. Here we are. What can I do against you, kiddos? We can do a quick check on ignition. Ignition check? 96%? Yeah, okay. That's that's definitely not quite there yet. We're still working on it. We're, get, we're trying, we're trying. Should maybe take off fighting for now. Let's just focus down fire magic. That would potentially be the, uh, the lifesaver we need to get through this area. Alternatively, do we want to just bring Maybe Lightning's Fire into the mix, give it a shot at the very least, see if that can't be the uh, mana efficiency we so desire in life. Divine Exegesis is only a 10% failure rate, so that's another option that we at the very least have available to us to try out. Keep forgetting that our shield is poison resistant and panicking, but no, no, we should be okay in that regard for the moment here. Let's just lightning these sons of guns. Radiate you. Get absolutely bodied, my friends. And another gift. <gasps> Shifting. Oh my gosh. It's too good to be true. Well, 
Pick that bad boy up. And where do we sit on statue form here? Already at 86%. I'm sorry, ignition. Step out the way. Earth magic. You're my new main squeeze. Let's bring you up to... They sound like eight. And then transmutations will bring up to... How are we feeling? 14 maybe? Might be overkill. We'll see how long that takes. But while we're at it, transmutations can be slow burn. We'll quick focus down. Earth magic seen as how the first few levels of any skill are generally way faster than any alternatives. And Stone Arrow, oh, unfortunately Stone Arrow is already maxed out. I was curious if the addition of Earth Magic would do anything for us in that department. Doesn't seem to be the case, but still very much worth the, uh, the trouble, I would say. And if all of my new friends could uh, come and say hello here, we will absolutely just split it right down the middle. Go for the turkey here. For all my bowling fans out there, my bowling fanatics, you know who you are. Which I hope so, because I have no idea. We've never talked about bowling before, but I'm sure there are some of you out there. Bowling's a pretty sick game. That's another thing that I haven't done in a long time, but really want to, uh, to do again at some point. I always have a lot of fun bowling, especially, you know, in a, a very casual setting where you can get a little silly with it. I try and toe the line. I mean, I definitely don't want to uh, annoy any employees at bullying establishments. Wait, are you still corrupting? I thought you could only do this limited number of times. Well, that's rough. What the heck am I gonna do with you, McWaddle? Besides so just leave for the moment here, let's uh, let's just take a chill pill. Because now that I have statue form on the list, I feel like we have to think about this another time. Definitely been a lot of thinking going on this run, but such is the case when you're constantly at the, uh, the cusp of life and death itself. But essentially, if we can just get some more experience, Statue form is going to make everything so much easier. So, we could try out vaults. We could try out elf. Elf would be slightly terrifying, but at least our uh, Ogleb's Toxic Radiance and Ignite Poison combo would be more effective there than it is in Snake. So we could try and clear through the first layer or two. And should go well. Dancing weapons. I guess electricity is no good have irradiate though irradiate is kind of the one-stop shop for all your murdering needs so we could try that out how are we sitting for resistances we either have cold or fire resistance not really an option at both at least not if i want to keep electricity resistance and willpower around which don't get me wrong i definitely do so let us head to the Elven Halls and see if that is the uh, the ticket to fame that we so desire. Might be the worst decision I've ever made. Holy moly. Do I dare? Oh my gosh, would this be so, mm, so satisfying if I can murder all these sons of guns. Actually, we have Divine Exegesis. So normally there's the issue of not putting the cart before the horse. You know, making sure that you have your balls in order here. But I could cast Statue Form once and hope that that gives me the defenses I need to get through these Sons of Guns. Force Lance will ruin my life, of course. There is that to contend with. We have Pyromancers and Elf Knights. So we have Cold and Fire, all in one sweet, sweet package. Hmm. Now this one at least deserves a moment of, of thought, of introspection. 
because if I can kill all these buddies, that's already a huge amount of experience at our disposal. I just know the alternative. I guess even if I try and head upstairs, this might kill me, right? Maybe not. Only one, two, three have noticed me, so we have that running for us. Let's try this out. Divine Exegesis. I want statue form. Then I need everyone poisoned immediately here. And we're igniting that stuff. Oh, baby. Now that's what it's all about. Wow, wow. And they're dead. Okay. So that definitely, uh, needless to say, worked out in our favor. Fantastic. And yeah, let's take a quick peek. Earth Magic already at 4.3. If we check in on statue form, it was at 75%, down to 52 in that one bit of combat. So risky? Oh, 100%. Worth it though? I mean, results kind of just speak for themselves, no? Ooh, leather armor of poison resistance. You, my friend, are a problem child. Let's uh, ignore you for now. As unfortunately, most problem children are treated in the education system when usually, at least historically, that just meant that you you probably just had ADD and they didn't were not equipped to deal with any kind of uh, accepted learning practices. Jeez Louise, sorry, my brain broke there for a second. We'll, we'll get there eventually. Any kind of non-neurotypical. There we go. That was probably what my brain was desperately trying to uh, make heads or tails of and just couldn't quite get there. You can blink away. Hey, my friend. I hate, I hate that. But if I reach out and grab ya... Okay. Oh my gosh. Well, that went downhill real fast. Let's let's chill for a second here, Trinsky. Triple willpower. Oh, you're ghostly, right? Well, that may have just uh, ruined our odds of success here, and I was feeling so so good too. Well, what do we wish to do with you, my friend? Let's check our spellbook to see if Divine Edge Jesus can just save my life. When Dave gave for bit you see we're murdering elves, you approve? Well, I'm glad. We do it for you. Save it every time. It's always for your greater glory. Hashtag just DCSS things, indeed. But okie dokie, what the heck do I do with you, my friend? Ignition won't kill you, I don't think. Fear scroll won't do the trick. No blinking left, unfortunately. So that's one of the few options that could potentially save us here. Triple willpower means no petrify wand. As like any shot of working. So yeah, instead of just mindlessly attacking with my sword, which I'm terrible at using, no training with, Definitely should have been channeling some magic and murdering this son of a gun. Whoops. To put it lightly. So let's see. 3d22 or 2d18. 2d18 we can heal through if I just start chugging heal wounds. Bolt of draining? Uh, not so much. Not so much. That's uh, that's probably what just hit us there if we take a bit look. Quick look, rather. Bolt of negative energy hit us. Yep. Yippers. So, one option. We could drink heal wounds, hope for a low roll, just enough to get us back in, and then drink lignification. That gives us all of the positive energy we need to potentially survive this fight, as well as the AC. So it's still a, a risky proposition, all things considered, but would potentially get us there. Let's not accidentally make a move here either. I'm always very 
hesitant about that when you think you're in the explore mode here and moving your cursor and then you accidentally just swing at the enemy and, and die by consequence. Not ideal. 12 damage plus your plus 3 longsword. That we can also heal through, I believe. So I think it's going to be a heal wounds. And just everyone can collectively cross their fingers together here. I see that my, my bit rate is currently having issues. What a time. What a time to be alive. Well, I mean, we never don't have it, so I'm sure we'll be fine. Up to 33 health. I will go Lig then. Okay. I think, does Lig not give us positive energy? I thought it gave us resistance to negativity, but... Turns out maybe not. Drink one more heal. And she engaged indeed. That puts it lightly. Let's channel magic. And then irradiate will save the day. And like I said, never didn't have it. I like I wasn't scared. I hope you weren't scared. I'd hate to, you know, unrightfully put you into a state of fear when we obviously had it in the bag the whole time. But fantastic. Let's just uh Roll past it and not think too hard about what we just uh, dealt with there and instead just hold on to the blind belief that we do in fact never not have it and we shall continue to never not have it till the end of days. And it just works. Well, let's definitely get all you sons of guns feeling the, the sting of my blade here. Yeah, these these dang archers definitely have a, a bit of a an issue against us. Oh, thanks game for not letting me do that stupidly. I was trying to hit this son of a gun. Perfect. And there we go. Now we actually hit them. Always have to pay attention to the, the sight lines in the game, of course, but we got there in the end. And again, if we do a quick check-in on ye old statue form, how are we feeling? How are we looking? 38% baby it's falling fast and there's our first dancing weapon it unfortunately is a uh, a pole arm with reach which is not the ideal circumstance for us I guess we can do something like this and never mind get absolutely wrecked I just didn't want to spend the turn having to step into them because that seemed like a potential nightmare scenario in the waking but or in the making, rather. But hey, we got there in the end. And... Purple Flail hurts real bad. Almost as terrible as when I just stupidly let things happen in front of my very eyes. But hey. Again. We, uh, we always get there in the end, don't we, folks? It's all about the, the elves we murdered along the way. The real lesson was the elves we murdered along the way. Okie dokie. Final statue check. Statue check for the folks. 34. We have one more floor to do it. You hear distant wind, so desolation of salt. Not one shot. Definitely not. You cannot convince me for even a moment that that is baseline intelligent idea so let's just get the heck out of dodge before I convince myself otherwise and a high priest is definitely a heavier contender than what we've had to deal with so far but that doesn't mean we have to uh, give up on life Jeez Louise my friend we should probably learn statue form you know at least so we could try to the throw at the spaghetti at the wall until something sticks. I mean, 32%, obviously not good, but generally better than death in my books. So, okay, what can I do against you with your 30 damage, my friend? I guess I just have to step up and then try and murder you in one hit, eh? It's really the only... The only way or two hits honestly that works out just fine a little bit of extra panic for no real reason but you never know when that is going to take a very different uh turn unfortunately 
And we'll just keep drastically poisoning and murdering these people. You know, if it works, it works. Yeah, you blink out of there. I will also do my own vanishing magic trick and just head upstairs, get the heck out of dodge. Fortunately, elves don't have object permanence. They're basically three-year-old toddlers, so you can just head up the stairs and they forgot you ever existed. It's a pretty sweet deal. And now, do I want to go through with that potential plan? Learn statue form? Did we ever get iron shot online? We have not yet. In fact, there she is. It is coming down. We are training the earth magic required. It's probably on the list for the future, but I'm also kind of adding, just constantly adding spells to the list here. It's pretty much like my games I want to play on stream list at this point, and just unachievable by any normal means within a, a character's or my lifespan. So, I mean, almost definitely we'll learn it at some point just because it will be naturally castable and especially if we get something like Spellforge Servitor, I'd love for it to just be flinging iron shots out left and right, but I'm going to focus down statue form and then we'll, we'll go from there. Maybe go back to ignition because I do really want to have some kind of non-poison AoE available to us. We'll see how she goes. But regardless, statue form, welcome to the team. Again, that distant wind. Can't believe you're still here. It really doesn't take a no for an answer, apparently, because, again, let's be frank, no shot. Not even a little bit of a an inkling in the back of my mind. And you know how my brain works. If you watch us through any of this series, you know that I will constantly do things that have the most minimal chance of success but would be kind of cool and I still cannot abide by the very thought of attempting anything so absurd. However, something less absurd is the fact that we just picked up dragon form, baby. <laughs> so not going to be very castable. In fact, yeah, 71%. But gosh, that also has to uh, potentially get placed down on the list. Let's uh, engage in some light bullying of our trident friend here. Please no one be around because I really want to achieve this. You're still in here. Crud. Never mind. I wasted all that time trying to lock them in a room with no, uh, no escape. But it's cool. It's cool. I didn't, I didn't care that much, I guess. It's fine. I'm not upset. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed is all. And the rest of you can get murdered. Fantastic. I guess that's something I've kind of been forgetting that we even have in our repertoire of spells here is IMB and we can always just blast these weapons off my back if it starts to get at all uh, concerning. So should probably keep that at the back of my mind at the very least. Otherwise, we'll just uh, keep chugging along here. We're just about at the sweet spot. Need but a moment. Ooh. Requirement scroll. A very expensive requirement scroll. I will immediately buy summoning, on the other hand, because that is worth its weight in gold. Magic mapping gets at least marked as a potential buy in the future, similar to silence. And do I get the acquirement? I'd love an artifact ring. Spellbook? Probably don't need. Sif has got our back in that regard. You got no guarantee we get any more shops anytime soon. Let's grab that bad boy. Read scroll of acquirement. Hat of death resistance. If only you did what you say on the tin. Regardless, we don't currently have a hat. Might as well put on... Is it a an old timey wizard's hat? Is it a party hat? Is it a dunce cap? You be the judge of that, I guess. Regardless, it's going on our head. Going on my dumb sack here. And looks way different on our, our little icon here, our little pal set. Can't decide yet if it's in a good way or a bad way. Is it like a beret? Is it a bit of a, like, sailor's cap? Honestly, who can tell these things? The important part is that I guess we're wearing it now. 
Oh, excuse me, Trident Friend. Okay, never mind. I didn't want to hang out anyway. And where does that leave us? Statue form at 21%. That, my friends, is technically feasible. The best kind of possible. So let's head back here. It is, oh right, it's McGlottle. So actually, statue form ne isn't necessarily the be all end all of my success. Do I have the resources necessary for McGlottel? I guess statue form at least gives us the possibility of just going absolutely ham with uh, Irradiate, which is basically the best unique killer in the game. A few of those and almost anything is gonna be brought to bear, but we'd have to survive that long. And me too, Saved. I too cannot wait to see the Dragopode. Well, we'll get there one day. It's the, the dream for the future here. Trend Station's continuing to train. We'll probably bring it higher than 14 now that we know we have that available. Hmm. Well, to start off, let's set statue form to a different key so I can cast it a bit more easily. Glottal, why couldn't you be where I needed you to? Okay, now you're coming at us. Oh my gosh. Again, of course we get statue form successfully cast every time when we're at a bad cast rate. And I, I worry that that's not going to hold true for when we desperately need it in the future. And it should be way more feasible. But hey. And... Okay. You are resistant to electricity. But I'm, I'm also very likely to take... Uh, a decent amount of mutation energy if we do even a single more uh, irradiate. How much is my life worth, I guess, is what it comes down to to a certain extent. I could just acid wand you, 90% chance to hit. There's that. What else? Cannot cause fear on me at the moment. You have the might. And all of that good stuff. 140 health means you probably still have a decent chunk left. One of acid is 45 at base. You know what, let's start there. Oh, and we, we murder them. Fantastic. Okay. Start and end as it should be. Beautiful. Um, well, I guess that's one way to deal with life's problems. And I'm curious just how much experience that gave alone. Statue form is still not that much more castable. And you friends, if you could just come right this way. All right, I'm also very slow when I'm a statue. That is always important to keep in mind. I don't know why I'm again just ab fighting against any enemy in this game. That's probably not in the best interests of the whole, you know, not dying a horrible death thing. I'd love to be proven wrong, though. Always a uh, lovely experience. And fantastic. Oh, no, do not hit myself. That doesn't seem like the, uh, the play here. Hitting all these snakes with copious amounts of electricity, on the other hand. Very much the play. Very cool, very legal. And way up my alley. And let's just head back to a, a brief respite here. Fantastic. Satch form, of course, just becoming more and more uh, castable as we speak. <laughs> I say as I fail it a couple of times, but again, not the end of the world. That is the, the kind of beauty of transmutations across the board is that you can afford to do a lot more failures before you finally get it popping and generally still wind up in a half decent spot because it lasts long enough to uh to make you forget about all the times you missed your shot fantastic lightning bolt definitely going to be one of the main contenders for dealing with snake across the board here and we're back to to making some kind of forward progress which is just lovely and fire susceptible to cold. We don't really do any of those. Hmm. Ooh, ooh, 
oof, oof. Let's do a quick little, quick little stretch here. Oh, work out all those kinks. I'm so excited to sleep in a real bed tonight. It is going to be lovely. I just hope that I can get up for work in the morning. <laughs> so that's something I didn't consider until earlier today. Is that I'm going from rough sleeps to the comfiest of mattresses and it's probably going to uh, be tempting to a large extent to uh, hang out there for as long as possible. Uh, nope. As soon as you see a guardian serpent, you get the heck out of there. That is very much a uh, a nope kind of scenario. I guess we could, in statue form, head down. And that's better. Definitely better. Okay. Turns out he can keep getting away with it. Fantastic really don't need any kind of success rate with your transmutations if you just uh, stare dance and abuse the enemy AI to your heart's content. So there is that to keep in mind. Ooh, and of course there do end up being a decent number of extra shops here. Well, that is slightly unfortunate, but I'm sure we'll we'll still have enough money, especially over the course of the run in its entirety, to uh, to take advantage of just such an occasion. 